Ho ho ho! Welcome to the Carrot Pie High December Christmas Special. If you didn't know, I'm not Santa Claus. But anyway, let's get into the video. Um, today we're going to be talking about the shittiest Christmas film of 2019. Do 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 do. Roll intro. So, with that cringy intro out of the way, um, let's get into why I hate the Christmas movie known on Disney Plus as Noel. Now, I think that Noel is, in all regards, a terrible movie. It, I would say, is the worst blockbuster Christmas movie ever created. A lot of people have said Santa, the Santa Clauses, but after watching both um, one after the other, I will say Noel is worse. Now, there's a lot of reasons why I think this. The, um, there are two big ones, though, that I'm going to cover in this video. There is the plot incoherence, basically the lack of a, um, uh, coherent and, uh, I guess linear story, and the fact that the movie is all based on one singular idea. Um, so I'm gonna get into the first part right now. So basically, the first part of this is the lack of a more linear story. Now, the story is quite simple. Santa leaves uh, Santa Land or the North Pole, the, well, the replacement for Santa, um, then he, he ends up in Phoenix, Arizona, which I don't know why they chose that place. I guess it's just because, uh, then, uh, his sister goes to find him. He, she finds him and she makes friends with these two people. One's a kid and one's an adult. Then they go back home and he turns out not to be a good candidate for Santa. And she's a better candidate for Santa. So she becomes Santa. And this is where the plot kind of breaks for me. Now, up to this point, the main conflict in, of the film was trying to get Santa back, and the resolution of the film, well, the resolution at that point, would have been that they, she was the new Santa, and she took off in the night to do santa -y things of putting presents and things and that kind of stuff, but it doesn't end. Like, they have another, like, two like, hour of film, it doesn't make any sense with what we've had so far. It's like they had two films and just meshed them together because they were, didn't have enough runtime in the one to make it a film, the first or the second, so they just meshed them and poorly wrote them in grading them together. Now, it's not all bad. There are some good elements, like the performances from most of the actors I really liked. Um, especially Noelle. She did a very good job with act just general work. She never really did any major mistakes. I like the kid. He was also very good for a kid actor. Um, the brother was a little uh, iffy at some points. Um, uh, there weren't really other major characters. I really like the nanny, though, like, um, Noelle's, um, I guess it's, like, Nan, Nana, or her guardian, or whatever, but anyway, um, other than that, there's not really much good to the movie. Now, I'm gonna talk about the, the bad part now, um, well, another bad piece of it. This bad part is about the, um, shoot. So, the next part of this is probably the underlying issue with the movie and why it turned out so bad. Now, this issue is, as I mentioned earlier, the singular idea of the movie. There is one single idea that is hammered in the entire film. Well, not the entire film, more at the mid-film resolution, which that's not even a real thing in films, but for some reason it isn't Noelle. But 
it is the idea of a female Santa, which isn't a terrible idea on its own. It could be spun off into a bunch of different things. But the problem with it arises with the fact that it doesn't... It, it was the whole film was based on this one idea. It wasn't an idea that could make a film. It was an idea that could make a um, short story or something like that. And that's what it does. The first half is good. I would say it would be an average Christmas movie. Um, but it's the fact that it just it's the second half of the film is so terrible. Because of the fact that it just kind of bases the entire second half off of one idea. And it's just the whole time, it's the repetitive repeating of that idea over and over and over until it gets hammered into your head. The idea of a female Santa. Mm, it's a female Santa just punching into your head. Um, now, I'm not saying that's a bad thing. I'm not saying that the film, it's not a bad idea to have a female Santa. But the problem is when it keeps... Sucking its own dick, basically. It keeps saying, oh my god, we're, we have a female Santa. We're so progressive. Oh my god, wow. We're so progressive. We Give us money, Disney Plus. Pay us, you dumb fucks. Pay us money, please. Get our Disney Plus service. Um, but it's just so stupid. Like, it doesn't make any... Like, the second half just is completely stupid. And it doesn't align with anything that the first half was about. It, it's just Santa activities, but instead of Santa being a guy, it's a woman. And everyone's judging the woman, and she's like, hey, I'm a woman, and you can't speak to me like that. That, that, that. Why? Why not just end it where it should have ended, at the resolution of the literal film? Instead, keep going. Maybe they could have shown a little montage at the end of the film of the, her giving presents to children. But it doesn't make any sense. Maybe a second film made it, might have made that better. I don't know. It just kind of hurts. Because it, it, this film could have actually been good. You know it could have been good. The resolution was fine. But they had to keep going. It doesn't make any sense. In any regard. Now, I know I just ranted a little there. And I'm my voice is a little... Uh, dry if you haven't noticed um it's currently where i am living freezing cold in my room but i kind of i want to get a video out before um 2020 mainly because um my channel is probably going to shut down by that point i will still keep my production channel going but if this copa thing if the copa thing goes through as it's currently planned by the ftc i'm probably gonna have to shut down the channel um, and I'm probably going to delete all my videos on the channel because I don't want to get fined $42,000. Um, I probably won't because I'm a very small YouTuber, um, and I am, I probably won't matter to you guys very much, but, um, if you guys could just give this video a like before it's all over, that would be nice. Um, but let's hope for the best guys um I, I know this is kind of a little bit of a downer ending but um just remember to eat your carrots consume your pie please subscribe